All right, this video is going to be about how to calculate the electric field strength um, from a point charge in a vacuum. Um, if you want to see something about multiple point charges, um, go to the other video. Okay, so how can you calculate the strength of the electric field 1.5 centimeters from a positive 10 microcoulomb charge. Well, if you remember from before, the strength of an electric field is equal to 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught. Um, so this assumes that we're in a vacuum. If we're not in a vacuum, you need to use something other than the permittivity of free space, which will probably be given um, by the problem you're working with. Um, let's move on times the charge over the distance from the charge squared. Okay, so let's start by this problem by converting these two quantities, 1.5 centimeters um, and 10 microcoulombs, into something um, that matches the units of our permittivity of free space here. So this needs to be changed into meters and this needs to be changed into coulombs. So let's see, so our charge is equal to one, 10 microcoulombs, positive 10 microcoulombs, which is the equivalent of 10 times 10 to the minus six coulombs. Our distance R is equal to 1.5 centimeters, which is equal to 1.5 times 10 to the minus two meters. Okay, now that we've done our conversions, we're ready to start finding the electric field strength 1.5 centimeters from our charge. Okay, so I write 1 over 4 pi epsilon over our charge, which is 10 times 10 to the minus 6 coulombs, divided by 1.5 times 10 to the minus 2 meters, then we're going to square this quantity because that's our distance. Okay, I multiply all of this out and I get 4 times 10 to the 8th newtons per coulomb. <clears throat> You'll notice that this is a positive quantity, which means that if I put a positive test charge in this um, area 1.5 centimeters from my uh, 10 microcoulomb charge, it would feel a repulsive force. So as before, a positive test charge would feel a repulse. Okay, let's try another one. That was pretty easy. What if I have a negative 0 0.85 millicoulomb charge 2.5 meters um, away. So what if I'm 2.5 meters away from a negative 0 0.85 millicoulomb charge? So we can start with our equation as we did before. The electric field strength is equal to 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught. We're still in a vacuum so we can use epsilon naught over our charge Q divided by our distance squared. In this case, we're in meters, so we don't need to do any conversion for our R value. So R is just 2.5 meters. It's already in meters. We're set. However, we are going to need to convert this millicoulomb charge. So 0 0.85 millicoulombs is equal to 0, negative 0 0.85 times 10 to the minus 3 coulombs. Okay, I can then just plug my values into my equation. Electric field strength is equal to 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught divided by our charge, negative 0 0.85 times 10 to the minus 3 coulombs divided by our distance of 2.5 meters squared. I multiply, I divide, I do all my math, and I get negative 1.2 times 10 to the 6th 
newtons per coulomb. So the electric field strength at this point in um, 2.5 meters away is negative 1.2 um, times 10 to the 6 newtons per coulomb. Notice that this is negative. which means that our positive test charge at this point would feel an attraction toward this negative charge. Okay, that's it.